A Children's Book About Lying by Joy Berry. This book is about Katie. Reading about Katie can help you understand and deal with lying. And then this monster jumped out and... Sometimes you might make up a story and tell it to other people for fun. An untrue story that is told for fun is called a fantasy. It is okay to tell a fantasy, but it's important to remember that the fantasy is not true. It is also important to make sure that others know it's not true. Did you really see a monster jump out? Of course not. I was telling you that story for fun. Whew. Sometimes you might say something that you think is true. Then later on you will discover that it's not true. When you do not know what you are saying is untrue, you are making a mistake. It is okay to make mistakes because no one is perfect. Everyone makes mistakes. This here says the ghosts are not real. I thought they were real. I didn't mean to tell you something that was not true. I think ghosts are real scary. Sometimes you might purposely tell someone something that is not true. When you do this, you are not telling a fantasy. You are not making a mistake. You are lying. Lying is trying to make someone believe something that is not true. It is deceiving or fooling someone on purpose. I think I'll tell mom I'm sick so she'll pay more attention to me. Mom, I'm sick. You don't look very sick. Lying is not a good thing to do. When you lie, you disappoint other people, you cause people to wonder if you ever tell the truth, and you cause people to stop trusting you. You don't look sick and you don't have a temperature. Are you telling me the truth? Are you really sick? Say ah. People who do not trust you might believe you when you are telling the truth. This is not good. There are times when you need to have people believe you. So, you should not lie. Mom, I'm sick. The last time you told me you were sick, you were lying. Now I'm not sure whether to believe you. Yeah, we don't trust you. There are many ways to tell lies. You can tell lies with your actions. You might cause someone to believe something that is not true by acting a certain way. You are lying when you do this. If mom finds out that I broke her vase, she'll be angry. I'll just throw it away and maybe she'll never know. You can tell lies with your silence. You might cause someone to believe something that is not true by not saying anything. You are lying when you do this. Does anyone know what happened to the vase that was on the table? If I don't say anything, she'll never know that I broke it. Uh, don't you know about that vase? You can tell lies with your words. You might cause someone to believe something by saying things that are untrue. You are lying when you do this. Do you know what happened to the vase that was on the table in the hall? No, I haven't seen it in a long time. Ugh, that's a lie. People usually find out when you lie to them. KD, please come here. Do not try to cover up lies by telling more lies. This will only make things worse. Did you do this? Should I tell the truth? Tell the truth if you have lied. Admit that you have lied. Say, I lied to you. This will make things better. I lied to you when I said I hadn't seen the vase for a long time. Say that you are sorry if you have lied. I'm sorry. What a mess. Do everything you can to show that you are truly sorry you lied. Do not tell any more lies. I can play for the vase with the money I got for my birthday. Not a bad idea. If you want people to believe and trust you, you must not lie to them. It pays to not lie.